Hello, this is Hamid and in this session I'm going to teach you how to set up FortiGate for virtual IP address and you will learn how to set up the port forwarding in this session. So as you can see here we have a FortiGate device with three ports. Port 3 is set as a DHCP client and we receive uh, internet uh, from this port and port 4 is set as an outside port so as you can see that i have already set the firefox here so the role of firefox firefox here is to uh, reach and translate this ip address uh, to the local ip address and here we have two devices the router and uh, we have the wordpress that is our web server and what I'm gonna do here, I'm translating this IP address 10.10.10.1 10, 10, to uh, 192.168.10.24. So uh, let me, the first step is to connect to the firewall, but before that, uh, I'm gonna check the IP address of the WordPress. And so here, I have the WordPress and the IP address is 192.168.119 you can check it with fconfig and so then I connect to Kali Linux and here I uh, in the policy and objects virtual IP you can set the uh, new virtual IP address so I call this one WordPress and so the traffic is coming from the port 4 so I called uh, the interface is port 4 and the external IP address of port 4 is 10 10 10 1 and it is mapped to the IP address of the WordPress and it was 119 let me check it again yep 119 so we have different options here for port forwarding so if you enable the port forwarding you can port have an option of tcp udp and uh, different protocols so here in our scenario the external service port is 80 and I'm mapping to port 80 of our web servers. Uh, you can have different ports and different map ports. So in my case, because port 80 is free and available, I can use it uh, as an external service port. Then the next step uh, is to create this policy and I go to IPv4 policy and create new policy and here I call this one WordPress uh, policy so the incoming interface based on diagram here we have port 4 and the outgoing interface is let me show it here the outgoing interface is port 2 so i select port 2 here a local interface and the source port you can set a specific range of ip address such as 10 10 10 2 or uh, uh, a specific uh, subnet ID in my case because uh, I am setting for all the network I just I, I can set that as a all and the destination is gonna be your virtual IP address that you created recently so I select the WordPress and then for the service because just we are surfing the HTTP and HTTPS select your http so http and https 
and then if you want to create a security profile you can set it here otherwise you can create it and click on OK now we have the security policy so mm, the next step is going to be go to Firefox and just uh, because I've already set the IP address for the Firefox is 10 10 10 2 so you just open the browser and enter the 10 10 10 1 so let's see what's gonna happen perfect so now 10 10 10 1 is translated to 192.168.119 and we can reach the WordPress web server. I hope this has been informative and thank you for watching.